Good morning, Grandpa. Good morning, Mohan. Let us go for a walk in the garden. Wow, it is a lovely, fresh and green garden. Yes, my dear son. This garden has many small and big plants. Yes, Grandpa. All these plants are so leafy. Yes, Mohan. Leaves are an important part of a plant. They not only make them look fresh, but also perform many important functions. Mohan's grandpa told him that leaves are an important part of the plant. So let us learn about leaves. Firstly, let us observe the shape of the leaves of some plants. Different plants have different shaped leaves. The leaves of a people plant have heart-like shape, whereas the leaves of banana plant have long and flat shape. Leaves of grass in a garden have sword-like pointed shape. Let us see a leaf through a magnifying glass. You can see a line running through the center of the leaf. This is called the main vein or midrib. Leaves also have some fine lines on both sides of the main vein. These are called leaf veins or side veins. Based on the arrangement of leaf veins, there can be two types of leaves. In some leaves, leaf veins are arranged in criss-cross manner and form a network. In some other leaves, leaf veins are arranged parallel to each other as straight lines. If you see a leaf through a microscope, you will observe tiny pores on the surface of the leaf. These tiny pores are called stomata. Now let us understand the functions of leaves. Plants prepare their food with the help of their leaves. Through the stomata of their leaves, plants give oxygen and take carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. The carbon dioxide is used to make food in the presence of sunlight. The oxygen released by plants is used by human beings and animals for breathing. Some plants, like cabbage and lettuce, store prepared food in their leaves.